Alrighty, we are back. Let's design our torpedo boats. Tiny little crappy torpedo boats. We need a tower. Tower is an absolute must. And I don't believe I can put a torpedo launcher on the front. No. Although that's where the torpedo launcher would have been. Right there. It'd come out of that spot. But that is not in the game yet. So we have a two inch gun. And we're gonna plop on there. Um, yeah, the mount's not even tall enough, and we're already at uh, max displacement. Beautiful. <sighs> we don't even have funnels yet. Uh, standard funnel. Torpedo launcher. And the ship is seriously overweight. These early torpedo boats weren't the fastest things to ever exist. And it's only 15 inch torpedoes, each one only has two. Standard shells. Can I put like. And right now it's 40% engine efficiency. Is literally the best engine efficiency we've got. Nope, that's too heavy. So yeah, we're just gonna run with this little piece of crap that is not gonna be doing 25 knots. Not at all. Launch. That ship looks like it's listing pretty hard. That ship looks like it's listing quite badly. In fact, there's water on the deck right there. Five torpedo boats versus one dreadnought. Oof, that looked like it was about to be taken out right away. Where are the other two? There you are. And... Now let's detach everybody. What are you doing? Well, you're gone. Your main tower is destroyed. That's not a huge surprise. Uh, you be aggressive with your torpedoes. Very good. You've got them away. <coughs> you could have probably used to get them away sooner. You're launching. You come over that way. And then you get over there. You're doing only 13 knots. Oh, you're in pretty bad shape, seemingly. So can torpedo boats, at least at close range, take out a battleship? Destroyed main tower, fire. Engine destroyed. Torpedo hit. Two more torpedo hits. You can't even smoke up. Start turning away. Save your ammunition. And its situation is gone. So yeah, torpedo boats can take out a battleship at, well, at close range. This is kind of like a foregone conclusion thing. So, no, let's not play again. Um, let's increase the range by 6,000 and we'll design the ship. And it didn't save. So we have to have our little main gun. And then we have to have funnels. Oh, we need our tower. 
We're not using that one. We're not using that one. We're using that little tower. Funnels, standard funnel. Can I still fit torpedoes with an advanced funnel? Torpedoes are that size and that size only. Trying to fit torpedoes, but it's just kind of rather hard. And even with that, we still have abysmal engine efficiency. So yeah, the advertised speed is 25.5, but we're not going to be getting... We'll be getting like half that. At most. And that's just going to take up more space. So that's only 38 capacity. With the enhanced, it's 48.9% capacity. And I can't even fit a main gun there. And that gets us overweight. <sighs> and can I fit? I can fit another gun, but I kind of don't want to. <laughs> so yeah, the problem is we need... The small ships need more funnels. They need space for more funnels, and the funnels need to be made more effective. Smoke is spotted from the north. So go that way. Oh, they're all in the same squad. Okay, that's interesting. <clears throat> and can I detach you? You're detached. What are you doing? You're supposed to be detached. Work with him. And now what are you doing? I didn't order you to make that turn. Okay, so we're going to race in. The question is, can these guys get close enough to launch torpedoes from a distance? And with the accuracy of the time, it appears so. Oof. Okay, you have launched your torpedo. You're going to detach now, and you're already detached. So you're going to go that way, you're going to go that way, and you're going to start retreating. If you survive long enough to do so. Okay, do torpedo boat tactics actually work? Your speed is a whopping... You get 24 knots. That's... that's adequate. It looks like that torpedo is going to hit. So one of them has successfully done a torpedo attack. And there's the hit. Flooding. Hit to the stern area. Where's our torpedo? You got side mounted torpedoes. Oh, 
Look how fast these guys are doing. 23, almost 24 knots. You're going to get in closer. And then you're going to turn to starboard and launch. I heard something launch somewhere, so you're going to start your turn because the enemy battleship probably just launched a torpedo at you, of all things. Yeah, there it is. Or it's launched at this guy, who can't move because all of his engines are out. And aggressively launch your torpedoes, please. There you go. You can now turn away. Nope, you're sinking. So that torpedo is away and going to most likely miss. He's down to 34%. You're going to turn directly at him. You're going to turn that way. Situation is that that torpedo, that this torpedo boat is threading the needle. Very nice. And we now have another midship hit. On Lily. For more flooding. Which is good, because it's not like... It's not like the guns are going to do anything to it. Be aggressive with your torpedoes. Your deck is awash in the heavy seas. Oh yeah, just sail right alongside. <clears throat> You're swinging your torpedoes into place as long as you don't get hit. main tower fire. You have now launched your torpedoes. You can now also turn away. Although your rudder is now damaged, so maybe you can't. <coughs> this is down to 12%. But with another hit. Flooding. And that has extended down the rest of the length of the battleship, and boom. So a torpedo boat squadron can reasonably pull off an attack on some on a battleship. Maybe not an entire fleet, but a lone battleship, yes. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we will be back next time. See ya. Thank you all for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to hit that stupid little bell thing that YouTube has added, because otherwise you won't get notifications of any new videos if you su subscribe. Also, follow me on Twitter, at GenJeft, as I always have my video updates on there, so you will never miss a video if you're on my Twitter feed, because they'll all be posted, and any other dumbass comment I make as well. So, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.